Hi Leo, welcome to your daily guidance reading here at Chelsea Love Tarot. Today I'm going to do something a little bit different. I like to do a reading to find out how this person you are connecting with feel about you, okay? And uh, this is a love reading, obviously, so please bear in mind that roles also can be reversed. Leo, let's get to your reading. And thank you to those who have subscribed to my channel. I really appreciate your love and support. Spirits and angels, please show us how does this person Leo is connecting with feel about them? How does this person... Okay. Two. I feel like Leo, they think you are a missed opportunity or that you are unwilling to accept um, their offer or their cup because you are very dissatisfied about them or the situation. And, you know, I do see a breakup here. Um, you could have had a relationship or even a family or even have been married if that applies to you. Ten of Cups is in reverse. And they're very disappointed with how things panned out or did not pan out. And again, with the Page of Cups in reverse, I also feel like um, it's like you're not accepting their offer. You probably could have blocked communication or don't really want to communicate with them much. And they think that you are still heartbroken. You know, could have been a third party situation. And they are also still very heartbroken with the fact, yep, with the High Priestess card here. Um, there is very little or no communication right now. Everybody is sort of keeping quiet. He's keeping quiet, you're keeping quiet, or she's keeping quiet, and you're keeping quiet. And also, I feel like they want to come back into your life because of the Five of Pentacles in reverse. They want to come back into your life or into the house if you guys used to live together. Um, they probably, if you guys were living together, they probably have moved out or both of you have gone separate ways. And Ace of Cups is also in reverse. I somehow feel that um, with it being reversed, this could have been a love connection that both of you were actually have loved each other a lot tremendously and have thought about being with each other for the rest of your lives um, however it obviously it didn't pan out so there's a lot of there are a lot of regrets disappointments and you know crying over spilled milk and I also see the Empress card is in reverse here um, if you guys have been married before because the Empress you know with Usually it means like a wife or a mother character. Um, it, it is in reverse here. So I feel like if Leo you're dealing with either um, Taurus, Libra, could also be a Virgo because sometimes I do see the Empress card as a Virgo. Hmm. I also could be Sagittarius as well because of the temperance card right there but I do I feel like Leo this person used to see you as you know their lifelong partner but it has ended so they are very sad about the ending they are very regretful and re very remorseful of what had happened something that could have been a happily ever after did not turn out to be such so and also maybe I feel like they feel that you have moved on maybe they think or uh, they feel that they have you have moved on because of the world card here okay um, it's like ending the cycle and starting a new cycle and I also think like I feel like you know a, they, there's this sense of like of giving up okay I feel like they are sort of giving up on this connection because maybe they are thinking that you have moved on okay 
that you have completely shut the door on them and that you have closed this cycle with them and you know start something new you know with the ace of swords here too they feel like you know um someone has been cut off either you have cut them off or they have cut you off okay roles can be reversed but i feel like more so you have cut them off okay um something about some clarity and truth has come out someone has come to a realization that this is not working out or some truth about possibly could be a third party situation may or may not third party situation sometimes it may not mean another lover i could mean also external factors or uh, friends and family meddling into the connection here and also temperance card they feel like you are healing right now and you're trying to find seek your balance okay um probably also seeking for spiritual guidance and everything is sort of with it you know i also feel like with a high priestess card although they feel like maybe you have moved on and you have closed your you guys chapter of love you know your relationship um it looks like possibly you guys have been together for a while okay but i somehow feel like secretly secretly because of the high priestess card secretly maybe you they think that maybe you still love them that maybe secretly you would want a reconciliation with them okay or vice versa there is sort of like a bit of a waiting waiting here that i'm feeling that i'm sensing yeah ending two of cups in reverse someone was possibly being very selfish in this relationship in the past someone could have given up i feel like this is a cycle that has been going on uh, for quite a while it's almost like it's almost like it ended and then uh, possibly you took them back or they took you back okay roles can be reversed so it's like on and off on and off on and off but you guys were actually in a committed relationship someone could have cheated or betrayed you or broken your heart for whatever reason here i don't want to jump into you know the third party right away but there is definitely a heartbreak here definitely somebody was not thinking about the other person someone is being um greedy and selfish okay and being so unreasonable and also not i feel like not fully committed okay because the king of pentacles is a very grounded character here but it's in reverse so someone is not grounded for some reason or there could have been some financial uh, difficulties that have caused a lot of stress in your relationship because i also see the five of pentacles here and five of pentacles a lot of times when i do career reading of course it's not career reading this is a love reading right now but sometimes it could also signify um, difficulties in um, your finances or career sector okay but for some reason i feel like this could be one of the issues within your relationship i always believe that you know uh, actually i i think i read it somewhere where um statistic statistic statistics show sorry i'm really tired actually i was uh, reading till very late at night i mean private reading and i didn't quite get enough of sleep so um i'll be a little bit tongue-tied and i'll be a little bit slow but um what i'm seeing here is that the financial difficulties could have put a, a stress like add add stress into your relationship with each other there is no communication now it or very very little with the eight of um wands in reverse leo let's get you some advice okay 
after all this is a daily guidance reading so i like to give you guys some advice spirits and angels please show leo some advice and guidance messages for today 9 of june regarding your love situation Okay. So all of these wanted to come out. I'm just going to take them. Let's take a look. Worth waiting for. Divine timing is at work in your love life. Playfulness to recapture romance. Allow your inner youthful spirit of fun to shine it's a reverse and i'm just going to take it as a reverse make the effort great love is worth taking the steps you are guided to take honeymoon enjoy the bliss of holiday time together um, heart to heart conversations honestly discuss your feelings with each other well with all of these being um in reverse although i don't really most times I don't really read oracle cards in reverse, but for some reason I just feel like doing it right now. But I feel like there is definitely no um, conversations right now, no heart-to-heart -heart conversations. It's almost like this is something that needs to be done, whether if you guys want to get back together or not. You know, if nothing else, I feel like you guys deserve to have some sort of a closure. If that's what you're looking for okay sometimes it's hard to just move on and move forward or to forgive someone if you don't really talk about it discuss about it if you don't have the same understanding for each other and honeymoon is, is in reverse Leo I don't know why but I'm just feeling there's a lot of sadness here okay within either you or the other person or both of you um, because there's no honeymoon here okay it's in reverse I feel like no one is enjoying anything right now still going through the heartbreak and the ending of this relationship and i also see that no one is actually truly making the effort to communicate the right way or to communicate at all okay and also there is no playfulness i feel like there is a very sort of silent energy here between you and this person okay either you have blocked this person or this person has blocked you or or both blocked each other or both just don't want to talk to each other but it is something that is worth waiting for divine timing is at work in your love life i feel like also maybe if you feel that leo this is this is um that both of you maybe need some time to be apart first and to calm down to cool down before you actually start talking again or start um having heart to heart conversations I mean, um, yeah, maybe that's that's what you should be doing. Yeah. Could have been a third party situation, may or may not, or external factors, you know, meddling into your relationship. Yeah, there's no forward movement. I feel like because this is the fastest card in the deck, yeah, the Knight of Swords in reverse, it's supposed to be very fast, but it's in reverse. So something is like put at a halt right now so it depends on your situation Leo if you have not been if you haven't been speaking to each other um, and you feel like it has been dragged on for way too long and there's too much burden within this connection um, maybe it's time to you know speak up and have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation here um, whether if you guys come back together or not at least both of you understood and learned something from each other okay leo so this is the your daily guidance um today i just want to do something different because i do get bored easily so i like to change things up sometimes but i hope you resonated if you did please like share and subscribe i really appreciate that and also i do private reading my number is in the description box below you can whatsapp me to book a session with me leo so i will be seeing you tomorrow hopefully because i'll be doing your reading every single day take care leo bye